your Bibles with me, please, to Colossians, the third chapter. Colossians, the third chapter. Amen. 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 As we're turning on through, we will complete Colossians very soon, probably in one more Sunday. Amen. But I believe Colossians, the third chapter, has been a true blessing. Because this is one chapter that actually hits every facet of our lives, actually. Yeah. Thank you. Jesus. That's the one thing I love about it. Thank you, Today Lord. we're going to read Colossians, the third chapter, verses 18 through 21. I know you have it because I'll see you standing with me to your feet for the reading of God's word. Colossians, the third chapter, verses 18 through 21. Amen. 18 through 21. All right. And it reads, wives. Mm. See how hard it starts already? Mm. Wives, submit yourselves yeah. unto your own husbands. Yes, do that thing. Do that thing. As it is fit yeah. in the Lord. Yeah. Right. Husbands. Mm. <laughs> That's right, because they ain't gonna leave nobody out. <laughs> Love yeah. your wives and be not bitter no, 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 no. against you, them. You, Children, look at it. Keep right. going, doesn't it? Yes, sir. Obey your parents mm -hmm. in all things. Yes, sir. For this is well pleasing. To the Lord. Amen. Then it swings back yep. to husbands, but now it says oh, fathers. Amen. Amen. Provoke not, not, not your children Jesus. to anger, yes. lest they be what? Yes. Discouraged. Discouraged. Father, help us understand what you are trying to uh, uh, give us today yes. so Thank we can God. be you, able Lord. to be better in yes. our family yes. life. Thank Father. you, Lord. Thank so you, Lord. much is being destroyed yes, in Lord. families today. Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes. And we need your help. Yes. yes. We need your help. Yes, Lord. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Yes. Amen. 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 You may be seated. Amen. I would like uh, to say that. Uh, uh, 50 years ago, all families were so much better, but I'd be lying. <laughs> I'd be lying. Because the truth of the matter is, there's a lot of things that were here 50 years ago. Yeah. Can I just be honest about it? Amen. You know, the, yeah, I've, I've heard many, pool, many preachers in the pulpit get up and say, well, 50 years ago, things were so much better, but now things are just worse. No, things were just hidden better. Yeah. yeah. 50 yeah. years ago. Amen. Okay. Now, yeah. There were some families, yeah, definitely they were better. You know, there were some families that were, were they were handling things a lot better than they were uh, 50 and 60 uh, uh, years uh, now. Uh, uh, they were handling things better 50, 60 years ago than they are now. Mm -hmm. But the truth is, there were a lot of families that were not. They were just hiding things better. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There were a lot of wives that would have loved to go and file for divorce 50 and 60 years years ago, yeah. but it wasn't feasible because 50, 60, 70 years ago, women weren't in the workforce as much as they are now. Yeah. They were not as independent right, as yeah. they were now. Yeah. So therefore, it was not as easy yeah. then for women to do yeah. that Amen. thing as it is Amen. now. Amen. Now I know this again, don't you see, don't you, I thought, you, I, I knew y'all thought I was going to get up here and it's going to make it real sweet. For you, didn't it? But it doesn't work that way. I'm going to tell the truth. And that's just what it's going to be. It was not as easy. Yeah. You can you can, you can, can look at a man, a husband in some cases, and he have a family right in the midst mm -hmm. oh, yeah. of his other family. And gone back five blocks away. Hallelujah, Jesus. Before cell phones Hallelujah. and before the internet when you could just look up stuff on a person. Yeah. And he have a whole nother family. A whole nother family. Right on down the street. Yeah, Lord, have because I can tell you without a shadow of a doubt. See, you got to understand I am an authentic bastard child. But y'all will get that later. You see, so you can y'all can understand I know right. this is a right. true All fact. Right. All right, that is. That everything that looked good back then right now. Right now. wasn't 
That's right. Always good for you. Good <laughs> back then. Yeah. All right. Amen. A lot of things was hidden in the family. You see, right now, we have a lot of things going on where now you got uh, sex offender charges and, okay. and people yes, wearing yeah. this stuff Amen. because of the fact now, it, you know, they go to court for it and it's, right. they're labeled now. Yeah, 50, yeah, 60 yeah, years yeah. ago, they were doing the same thing, but it wasn't labeled. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And I can tell you for sure, African Americans are good to hide certain what things. What you say? What you say? Because this stuff was going on Amen. during this time. Yep. But they hid it. Yeah. And it was never brought out and people never did say it out loud. And mamas Amen. and daddies Amen. hid this stuff. Yeah. Amen. Hallelujah, Jesus. Yes, sir. Yeah, they yes, did. Sir. You don't know. You said, Pastor, where you going? I'm going to the truth. Uh-huh. Because see, in order to, to understand what God is trying to say in this word, you see, you've got to understand that the reason why there is turmoil is because this scripture that Paul was saying. Was not only is not only not followed now, but it was a problem back then. Yeah, got it. Amen. And if we're going to see a change, yeah. if we're going to see general generational curses broken okay. now, yeah. then you got to start acknowledging where the problem yeah. is. Amen. And the problem is yeah. we have problems. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. Amen. Yeah. yeah. Yes, I don't know why I'm going here and getting hot now. Amen. Right. Yeah. Hey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So we have got to come to this conclusion. Yeah. Yeah. You come down to the family and you 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 look at a unit here. You got a wife and you got a a, a, a husband mm -hmm. and then you got children. Yeah. Now the, the husband, first and foremost, uh, first of all, has to be a man. Amen. 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 I know. I know. I ain't got to the scripture yet, but I found something. I'm in Bible. All right, now. Yes, sir. Because the, the the problem is, we got men that aren't understanding that there were two jobs. That's us. And we get them out of order. Amen. Amen. The two jobs, but we get them out of order. Watch this, brother. Watch. Okay. No, two jobs. That's right. We get them out of order. The first is get a job. Right, that's it. That's the first thing. That's and then right. the second is be fruitful and multiply. Amen. Amen. But we get them out of order. You see, when God made Adam, he gave him a job. Name these animals. Figure out what they're supposed to do. Figure out what they what their name is and get them gone. That's exactly right. And yeah. then he said, okay, I'll tell you what, I'm gonna give you these women. Uh -huh. Give you this woman, brother. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> right. Give you right. this woman. Right. <laughs> and then we go about our business. That that's that was the order that God did. He yeah. gave him a job. Yeah. Then gave him a woman. That's right. That's right. But in today's time. <laughs> we get a woman and, 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 and a children. I mean, get a children. <laughs> and somehow, yeah. well, y'all laughing, but let yeah. me get y'all straight too yeah. now. <laughs> because y'all accept the man. I said so. Yeah. Oh, what you say? It's getting hot in here, not for real. Yeah. <laughs> oh, woo. Yeah. You accept the man out of order. Out of order. Out of order. You did say stay in the pool, but back to take the pool. Say that here, because I might need a little protection. Hey, All right. Don't be you see, yes, sir. you take the man That's right. out of order, That's right. and then when the man don't do right later, That's right. you don't understand That's right. That's right. why when you took him out of order. Out of order. That's right. That's right. You don't understand the problem yeah. when you took him yeah. out of order. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hallelujah, yeah. Jesus. Yeah. Stay in order. Yes, sir. Watch right out, Pastor. You're coming to shoot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> see, you yeah. see, Paul understood. Uh huh. A lot of these things that we're having problems now with. That's right. That's true. That's yeah. right. We want to say that the Bible today is out of date. No, 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 no. no sir. The Bible tries to explain to us that there's an order. 
Amen. We say that the Bible is out of date. Not out of date. Mm -hmm. Yet 50% plus of marriages end in divorce. Okay. That's right. 70% plus even in Duval County yeah. is still ending in divorce. But the Bible, yeah. the very thing that tells us there is an order to this thing, so. we say it is out of date. That's you right. see, that makes no sense. That's the right. very thing that you claim is out of date yeah. is the very thing that tries to tell you exactly what needs to happen yeah. to stay in order. Amen. Yes, sir. Amen. You see, there is a character to family That's right. that we've got to understand here. Yeah. Because this thing didn't start in the New Testament. It started way back at the beginning yeah. of, our, of time. Yeah. Yeah. You see, God knew how this thing was supposed to work yeah. when he developed this whole creation. Yeah. Here. Yeah. He yeah. understood how this thing yeah. was supposed to work. Amen. 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 You see, everybody that he had doing something, mm -hmm. there was an order placed. That's, That's right. right. That's right. You see, if you are trying to get a man that you want to love and cherish with, right. but yet, and don't get me wrong, because he might be able to love you the way you think you're supposed to be loved. <laughs> you know, went outside and picked you some flowers. <laughs> He done moved in your house. Uh oh, no, no, sir. From his mama's house. No, 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 no. Pass him back. Pass him back. He done cooked for you. That Lord. For you. From the food that you bought. Our children. Pick it up your food. No, no. And say, here you go, baby. I cooked today. Yeah, Lord. Not, not this baby. And see, see, here's the problem. See, I'm gonna show y'all something. See, because for, for whatever reason, the Lord has allowed me to share some things that a lot of people miss. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, I'm, I'm in the scripture. You just don't know it yet. Right? I know it. Y'all don't see it yet. Yeah, we got it. Because the reason why God talks about women being virgins, because see, when, yes, when God places a man and woman together, yep. He understood that when the, the sexual encounter right. happens, right. He right. knew there was supposed to be a spiritual connection. Amen. And then Amen. when that, if that man does yeah. it, and that man and woman comes together. Yep. Then yeah. it was, that woman was going to have not only a, a physical connection, but now an emotional and Amen. spiritual connection Amen. with this man. Yeah. It was going to be hard yeah. to break off. Amen. And let that man halfway know what he's doing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Now, I, I might be being a little bit too real. Oh, cool oh, bit, because you're a pastor, oh, pastor. Oh, and you shouldn't talk about that stuff. That's the problem right now. Yeah. Preachers don't want to be real yeah. with real people that's going through real problems. Yeah. Yeah. But now that ain't happening in the right direction. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. God called me here for a reason, and I'm going to tell it like it is. Yeah. Yeah. You know, you got, you know, got all yeah. cased up and caught up, wrapped up and tied up. And I ain't talking about with Jesus. Yeah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Amen. Now he in your house. That's no. He ain't cooking no more. He waiting on you to come home to cook. Because he know he done wrapped you up and tied you up. He know he done got you right where he wants you. You done came home. Now you cooking and wonder why this such and such ain't cooking anymore. You done called him every name under the sun under your breath. But you still put this plate on the table. Wondering why. And can't wait till you get in the bed right. with them in a little while. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, sir. <laughs> because you have forgotten that there was an order to this thing That's right. that right. you're not in. Yeah. Right. Hallelujah, Jesus. You got to be in the order. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Are you walking with you? We're walking with you, Pastor. We're walking with you. Yes, sir. You see, there's an order. There's an order. To this thing. Yes, yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Thank you, Jesus. So, Fast, but yeah, keep going. Let's rewind. You yeah. go forward from the beginning of Christ. I mean, the beginning of this creation, brother, when God made it. And when they were choosing wives, Abraham sent his servant to go find a wife. Yes, sir. 
in the family. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Isaac didn't go find his own. Amen. 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 Hallelujah, Jesus. Jacob loved the woman, but yeah. married three before he got uh, two before he got to the one that he wanted. Back then, they didn't have a lot of choice as to who they married. Amen. How many of you remember the color purple? Because y'all think that was just way back 5,000 years ago. How many of you remember the color purple? Oh, yeah. how, many of, how many of you remember the deal that was made you know, yeah. with the dad? Y'all remember that, don't you? That was how things worked even back then. And that was in America That's right. in the early 1900s. Yeah. What they didn't pick. Everybody wasn't choosing that's their right. own no. That's right. Husbands. Mate. Yeah, that's their right. Mates. Mm -hmm. That's exactly right. Biblical times, during this time, they didn't do that. Yeah. They negotiated. That's right. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I'm not going to stay on this long, but I need you to understand some things. That's right. That's right. Go ahead. And they stayed married longer then mm -hmm. when they didn't have a choice. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Then you do now when you do have a choice. Yes, sir. <laughs> and y'all want God to feel sorry for you because you chose the wrong person. How much the Lord? <laughs> you see, at least when their daddy chose, yeah. their daddy chose in order. Yes, you did. Amen. Did you get what I just said? Yeah. 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 You see, their daddy knew. That's right. I ain't picking nobody for this child of mine. That's right. That's right. See, y'all ain't got it yet. Right. I ain't choosing nobody for yeah. this child of yeah. mine yeah. that this That's child got to come back to me right. to get what they need. Yeah, y'all get your way. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Amen. Yeah. Amen. yeah. I'm right. preaching. Y'all just don't know yeah. it yet. Yeah. Jesus. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. That's what he did. Yes, right. And see, some of y'all parents need to hear this, too. <laughs> yeah. Some of y'all parents need to hear this too. Amen. 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 You see, you see, they knew yeah. that the choices they made was yeah. going to depend on their yeah. future. That's exactly right. That's Versus exactly now, right. when That's right. women right. make the choices. See, let me tell you why I don't feel, even when I counsel Lord, today, and I do counsel couples, I, I don't know do. why the Lord allows me to do so, but I thank God that He does. But I don't, I can't feel too sorry for, for, for marriage people uh, when I counsel them and I can't feel too sorry for those who are thinking about getting married that I counsel. Do you know why? Mm -hmm. Because they have a choice. Amen. Yeah. 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 They have a choice. Yeah. Thank you Lord for the choices. You yes, have a choice. I, I explain <laughs> if I counsel yes, that there is no one. Alright? <laughs> that's important to understand. Okay? Because if you decide to go out of order, then that is your decision. But don't come to me saying some foolishness that you done heard from some preacher out here saying that wasn't your wife and that wasn't your husband. Well, you made that choice. Don't do that. Don't do that. Because you made the choice and the minute you married, God ordained it. Yeah, hallelujah. Because you made the choice and you did. Amen. Amen. God doesn't not ordain because you made a stupid choice. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. And where pastors get that from, I don't know because it ain't in this word that I read. And I've read this word one or three times. Amen. Amen. Okay? Now, let me explain to you a couple things. You go back to when this word was written. Remember, right. they didn't have choices like that then. No, no. Now, right. now let's go to the word and let's read some things, right? The word says in 18, it says, why? Submit yourselves. Notice it did not say love. No. Yeah. Now, if you go back to the Ephesians, in the fifth chapter, around the 22nd somewhere verse, it says the same thing. Yes, it does. Like it's on one place it says for wise to love, and that's actually in a scripture, uh, read, uh, written latter part of these scriptures, right. and that's in Titus. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. But in these verses, it says submit. Hallelujah. Okay. But it tells the husbands to what? Love. 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 That's right. Why? Because they weren't choosing. That's, That's right. right. You see, love is an action word. Yes, That's it right. is. You see, the men had to love right. with action. That's right. Men, love your wives. Yeah. Ephesians says, like what? Christ, Christ loved the church. church. Amen. 
Yeah. You see, Christ didn't have to go around saying, I love you, I love you, I love you. No. Come on. Come on. Because I could tell you I love you all day long, but with no right shit backing it up, it doesn't even matter. All right, now. Okay? There's a lot of husbands that might tell you I love you, yeah. but if he laying in the bed while you going to work and ain't doing nothing by the time you get home, then that love ain't nothing. It ain't about nothing. No, sir. That's it. You see, you see, if, if there is nothing behind the love, yes. then there is no love. Hallelujah, Jesus. You see, That's because right. love is, is going to be some action. That's exactly right. That is exactly right. All right? Yeah. All right, no. And it's funny because women. I love y'all. Watch out, Pastor. Women are sentimental. Yes, we are. Emotional beings. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. You would rather hear the love than see it. Hallelujah. Isn't that interesting? Sometimes you need to hear it. You got to hear it. Sometimes. That man could have fussed all day and all night. He ain't did nothing. But then at the end of the night, when you feeling down and bad, he comes to you and give you a hug and say, I love you. No, sir. He got me going. And then all of a sudden, the sky brightens in the middle of a uh, in the middle of the night, and all of a sudden, no, sir. No, sir. That ain't how it works. Because sometimes it shows him. No, no, no. He's already gone. You see, you got to understand love. Is an action. So it men is. have that's to right. show action. That's why the Bible says, as Christ loves church. church. Yes, sir. Church. Amen. Amen. And gave his. That's the action. That's the action. That's it. That's right. That's right. That's, right. See, that's the action. Gave. That's exactly okay. it. Okay. But, but this scripture, uh, Paul flips the scripture. He says, wives submit. He says, the wife. he talks to the wives first here. That's what he said. says, submit yourselves. Not only submit yourselves, but submit yourselves husband. to your own husband. That's right. Now, here's some interesting stuff you need to understand before I explain to that. Go further up. Last week, we talked about fuel for your calling. Remember uh -huh. that? Uh -huh. And the things we talked about was uh, the word, because we was talking about the word dwells in you, right? Amen. The word brings maturity. Yeah. The word brings motivation. And yeah. the word brings and majesty. Ma ma um, ma uh, majest majesty. Majesty, right? Yeah. Uh, majesty, uh, which means yeah. greatness. You do things with greatness. Right. Then after that, he then goes into this whole family thing. Uh -huh. So maybe we need to realize that, first of all, in order to have a strong family, you got to have a word in you first. Yeah. Yes, yes. Maybe you don't have to understand that yes, before no. you really you get into this whole family. Yes. You got to understand what God says concerning Amen. the Amen. family before yes. you get into it. But a lot of times we don't do that. Hallelujah, no. Jesus. That's right. That's we we do it the way up. we think we should do it, <laughs> or we take bad examples yep. out there. That's right. You see, yeah. a lot of us, in my time, I grew up mm -hmm. in a single family home. Right. I did not have the best because I did not have a family in the sense that the God declared it right. to be. Amen. Okay. Amen. It's, not, it's Amen. not anybody's fault. Yeah. It's what it was. Amen. Amen. Okay. Or you got families where they're fighting every day or the dad is gone all the time or yeah. the mama's gone all yeah. the time. Yeah. yeah. But maybe if we understand what the word says about it. Mm -hmm. How much further we can get. Maybe we understood that with the word we do get maturity to have a family. Right. And maybe if we understand that if we if we are motivated to do what God says in a family, exactly. if we have the word in us. And maybe we will uh, have a family and do it the right way in greatness in God yes. if we have the word yes. in us. Yes. Amen. Amen. So let me tell you three things you need to get from this today. Yeah. Number one, hey, uh, the first thing we need to get is acknowledgement from wives. Amen. Mm -hmm. Second thing is adoration from husbands. Oh, yeah, Lord. And the third thing is abiding from children. That's right, yeah, Lord. If we can get those three things, maybe we can see some good family character. Amen. All right. First thing is acknowledgement from wives. It says to submit yourselves unto your own husband. Yep. Submit is to yield unto the authority. Yeah, you see, you is. can't have two leaders. Yeah, Whoa! What you say? You may think you can. <laughs> but you can't yeah. have two leaders. No. 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 Because somebody's going to have to make the last decision. Yeah. Somewhere. 
look at it. That's right. It's that's going right. to have to be a last decision Amen. made. Amen. And if there are two people that's not agreeing, yeah. somebody's yeah. got to step up. Yeah. And that somebody's got to be responsible yeah. for that decision. Yes, sir. He said, I don't care what the situation is. There's two. There's, uh, there's one thing you got to know. Uh -huh. That husband is always going to be responsible. Amen. Always. Amen. Amen. And I tell people, when it comes to divorce, yeah. no matter whose fault it is, that's right. that husband was responsible. That's right. Yeah. In the end, he's responsible. Yeah. Yeah. Because he's the one who should have been able to make the decision to be able to determine uh -huh. how this outcome should have been. That's right. We may not like it. Yeah. We may not agree with it. I don't care what you agree with because in the end, this is what this word says. Yeah. That I am the leader of yeah. this home. Right. So it's my fault. Amen. And Amen. I can say that yeah. with right. understanding okay. and remorse because I was there. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. So you've got to understand that as a man, uh -huh. you are a leader. That's you are right. a leader that was called to be in that position. Yeah. So yeah. this is no easy task. Amen. And you calling yourself, we're going to be equal partners 50-50. Uh -huh. uh -huh. You lying to yourself. Yes. You gotta know it. This is not some contract that you started a business. Yeah. This is the, that's the problem now. You got people entering marriage like a contract. Yeah. We yeah. come together uh, yeah. to pay yeah. bills. Yeah. We come yeah. together yeah. to be able to yeah. take care of a house and yeah. to pay 50-50 life bills. Yeah. Pay 50 Right. Hey, 50-50 right. water yeah. bill. Yeah. All yeah. this kind yeah. of foolishness. Yes, that is not how it That's works. Right. This is not some That's contract. This is an institution. Yeah. This is a God calling yeah. that God has put together yeah. that you are to honor and you are the leader yeah. of this thing. Amen. Amen. Yes, sir. For the idea of procreation yes, and keeping this life right. going yes. and sustaining this thing. That's right. That's right. That's right. To bring God and lift him up higher. See, if we are uh, looking at how the world does uh -huh. things, uh -huh. we right. will never see this thing come to fruition. Yeah, the but I fear because of the fact people Amen. are losing how the, the perspective God has. Yeah. Yeah. Things will get worse. Yes, it will. Yeah. Ah! Said, sir. Yeah. Yes, it but will. But the woman, ladies, Hallelujah, Jesus. you have to choose to acknowledge That's right. this man yeah. That's right. being the in the leadership That's right. position Amen. in the home. Amen. 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 But I suggest, if you decide to do so, yeah. Make sure you get him in order. Amen. Amen. Make sure he first of all has a job before you give him <laughs> yeah. your hand in marriage. Hallelujah, Jesus. Amen. Yes, sir. Married a broke man. Yeah. <laughs> Lord. And don't get me wrong, ladies, Lord. I have to understand because you got to understand too, there are going to be times where that man might go through something. Yeah. Okay. Don't right. marry a man for money. No, sir. No. Don't no, marry sir. a man because he got a good job. No, I, I, no, I, I, don't marry man. a man because the, the bottom line is you do know job. that there this man has a goal. This man has yeah. a, a, a heart to yeah. want to do right by you and That's do right, right by the family. That's because right. there are going to be layoffs. Of course it is. Lord. There are going to be Sickness. Yeah. There are going to be accidents and things like that that can always pop up in life. There are things like that. And you got to understand that you are submitted to this man and that that uh, to death do us part, uh, to sickness and in health, and uh, to rich poorness and the rich, whatever y'all, yeah, that thing is that we have to say y'all when y'all stand in front of Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. And you got to be, you got to be ready. That's yeah, right. everything. Hallelujah, Jesus. He got to be ready. There are going to be times that he may not be able to work it. You will have to work. Amen. But if you marry a man in order, he's going to understand that this is a temporary thing. That's at least right. the best of his ability. That's anyway. right. That's right. Hallelujah, Jesus. Okay, because you are, you're looking for a man with the heart to do right. Yes, yeah. right. hallelujah. Yes, Lord. That's important. Amen. 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 Yes, but then, uh, but then uh, we need adoration. From yeah. husbands these yeah. days. We, we're missing yeah. that. We're missing men who love their wives the way they're supposed to be loved. Yeah. Yes, sir. It's not about sex, man. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, yeah. It's, yeah. it's wonderful. You can put it down and all that kind of stuff. Let me tell you something. That's only for a minute. Yes, sir. When the bills, when the bills are due, all right, now. that only goes so far. Yeah, yes. my dad. Y'all should get him out of here. <laughs> Y'all can look at me like a crazy if you want. I know I'm telling the truth. Yes, sir. <laughs> that yeah, only goes so far. 
Preach it. And women, you, I told y'all this before. You looking for us to last forever? Like Keith Sweat used to say? Let me tell you something. By the time we hit 50 and 55 and 60, that forever starts becoming shorter and shorter. What you say? I'm just talking about what I'm talking about. Yes, sir. So all I'm simply saying is, love got to step outside of just the physical. Love, that's right. Yes, sir. Because love has to come further. It's got to go further than that. Love has to start well before that. Love has to start here. Love has to start here. Love has to start with what you do. Love has to start with, hey, you know what, God, no matter what goes on, I got you, girl. I got you no matter what. Hallelujah, Jesus. You don't just have this physically. You got me physically. Yeah. Because if I need to give my life for you, girl, like yeah, I got I got you. Yeah, Lord. Hallelujah. You see, this is what it's all about. That's right. That's exactly right. Thank you. Women, you got a man yeah. that will throw you out before he throw himself out. <laughs> well, now, he probably got the wrong man. Don't mess with them cats. <laughs> Y'all heard what she said. <laughs> Hallelujah, Jesus. Get out. You better know it. <laughs> you see, look, look at the Bible here. Yeah. Because it doesn't stop there. It says, love your wives and what? Be not bitter against them. That's right. That's right. Now, men. <laughs> yeah, that's what some of them do. <laughs> you see, we're not in Ephesians. Yeah. No. We're talking about Christ. Love loving the church, the church and, yeah, yeah. and giving themselves. See, right. see, yeah, we, that's nice to talk about. That. <laughs> uh, ba brace yourself. All right, now. We're talking about something totally different now. Y'all know. <laughs> Women, brace yourself because you ain't gonna like what I'm about to say. All right, now. So watch out, man. Deacons, I might need you to cross this eye here in a minute. Watch out, pastor. <laughs> Be prepared. You're the one that get prepared. <laughs> see, I told you, these just be ready. You see, there are going to be times where they ain't going to be happy. That's right. You see that shoe in her hand? She already ready. <laughs> there are going to be times where she ain't going to be happy. That's right. There are going to be times where she is going we don't like to use this term, ladies, mm -hmm. so forgive me for using it. Yeah. But we may look at it as you all nagging. Ah! <laughs> no, Saying no things that, good it Lord, why? Why? <laughs> why? <laughs> Can't you see him watching the game? Good goodness, I went to church with you this morning. I mean, all I'm asking is just to give me a good two hours for the game. Come on, that's all I'm asking. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. But tomorrow I promise. We got to do it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there are going to be times where, you know, you think everything should be happy. Everything's going well. She's not going to see it that way. She don't know. <laughs> yeah, Lottie. Uh, there's going to be times where you might be in one place and she's in another. Amen. Amen. I'm trying to be sweet here. I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm really right. trying at all. But the, the point of the matter is this. You still got to understand that you cannot be bitter against her. That's right. Praise the Lord. You see, I have, you, Lord. I have been, I have seen where Thank a you. man can say, look, I can't take it no more. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You, you ever seen the television shows where men get out work and they don't want to go home so they go to the bar? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. They got to go and Get a couple beers in. Yeah. 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 Okay, yeah. Like that. <laughs> so, so. How many of you? And I know, I know, I know. It's, it's at least one, one or three, if not in here, mm -hmm. out there. Yeah. Yeah. That when they get off, they go, they get home, mm -hmm. and they sit in a car, <laughs> and they sit, <laughs> and they sit, <laughs> and they. Sit. <laughs> 
I am not out. ready to do this. <laughs> yeah. This is what it's talking about. Right? Yeah, that's right. Okay. That, that's right. Man, we have got to understand that we have to still love our lives. Got to still like love. Whatever is going on. Amen. Right. Amen. You Thank see, you, Lord. We all have to. If, if you old enough to be old enough, mm -hmm. you know that. Ladies have a little change once a month at least. <laughs> at least. <laughs> at least up until a certain time. And then they might still have a little time sometimes. But yeah. Yeah. you have to understand that these things happen. They do. Yeah. And when it happens, you have to understand. You have to have some understanding about what's going on. Amen. Amen. And if you got a, if you have a wife that is trying to understand herself mm -hmm. and understand you, mm -hmm. she'll know what's going on. Yeah. That's right. right. Yeah. Okay. But the point is, man, love her. Hallelujah, Jesus. Be there for her. Yeah. This ain't the time yeah. to run and leave. Thank you, Lord. This ain't the time not to be home. Yeah. This ain't the time to, that's right, find another side to, that's right. to <laughs> lay up on her. Until she get over whatever she going on. And let me tell you something, man. That ain't pretty. That ain't cute. And I ain't trying to I ain't trying to be a pop calling the kettle black and yep. nothing like that. Listen, yep. Uh, yep. we all have done some stupid stuff in life. I'm, I'm not right. telling you that. Yeah, I'm, I'm just simply saying if you're doing it, just stop. Yeah. Yeah. Can I just, just be straight up and honest yeah, with man. you? If you're doing yeah. it, just stop. That's right. That's right. That's all. I'm not trying to judge anybody. Because right. I'm a man. We yeah. all have done some stupid stuff. Yes, sir. <laughs> I could be honest, right? Yes. yes. Yeah, Hallelujah, Jesus. Jesus. That's some stupid yeah, stuff. Yes, sir. Just stop. Just hey, say, man. you know what? I love my baby. Yes, sir. I don't start doing right. By that, that's right. That's right. And that's right. right. And ladies, hey, just man. have some understanding for your man. Hey, that's all. Else. But then it doesn't stop there. We got to go on because the time is going. Hey, Listen, Jesus. the next scripture says, the next scripture says, children. Obey your parents in says. all things. Amen. But this is well pleasing unto the Lord. Yes, uh, abiding, we need some abiding from children. The first commandment of, of promise is what? Honor thy father, father and thy mother for your days may be what? long upon the land which the Lord God giveth thee. I love these, Ten these Bible studies. Right. Yeah, that's Lord what I'm talking about. about. This, this is, this is, that's what it, we, we're talking about right God, now. Hallelujah, Jesus. Now we have got into some Dr. Spock age where nobody wants to spank children anymore and, yep. and that ain't doing it good and, and I, all these things. And I get that. Don't get me wrong. Yep. I've been spanked many, many, many times. Me I understand too. that. And me I do too. think that spanking has been overdone many times yep. by some of our yep. 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 I've been spanked yep. more than a few times yep. when I shouldn't have gotten spanked. Yeah, me too. Okay, I'm going to be honest about that. Me too. Okay? Yeah. I, I, I've been spanked when, you know, I've been popped over here, pop, pop, yep. pop, pop, yep. just simply because. I have been here. I've been here. I'm not telling you that it has not been overdone. Yeah. I'm just simply saying that if we do this in wisdom, yeah. it will be done right. That's right. I believe that if we love our children, yeah. talk to yeah. our children, give time with our children yeah. the way we're supposed to, do yeah. things with our children the way we're supposed right. to, That's find right. out what their likes and dislikes yeah. are, are the way we're supposed Hallelujah. to. And when they get in trouble, yeah. talk with yeah. them first, Amen. explain them some things. And then if we have to do some yeah. corrective action, yeah. then yeah. do some corrective action if that comes down to space. Yeah. Do it the correct way. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Amen. Okay. Yes, I think we'll get better because yeah. the problem is that verse 21, wow. uh, fathers provoke not your children. That's Sometimes right. we overdo it. Yeah. That's Sometimes we right. want to be disciplinarians with no love. That's right. Love that's right. right. And that's no good. Yeah. Not in the household. No, sir. You know, no, I was no I was nowhere near the best parent. I love my boys. Amen. And I think y'all know. I love my boys. Amen. I was nowhere near the best parent. I'm going to tell you what I did, though. Hallelujah. Every time I could, I gave them a hug. That's right. That's Every right. That. That's right. That's, That's good. Right. Amen. Every time yeah. I could, I give them a hug. That's right. I would kiss my boy. I don't care what to say. Yeah. That's right. And I'm a man as a, as a man could be. I would kiss them on the forehead. That's right. That's they could right. be 50 and I'll be yeah. 75. And guess what I'm going to do? Kiss them on the forehead. I'm going to kiss them on the forehead. Because that right. is, those are my boys. Yeah. yeah. I, I talk with them. I still talk with them. Yeah. The other day, I was talking to my oldest son. He's yeah. going to get this. I know he's going to have something to say. Yeah. I was talking to him, and I told him. I called him. I said, son, you know what? I can come out of retirement and spank that behind if I need to. <laughs> yeah, see, because see, it's just those my boys. I can still joke yeah. and have fun right. with my boys, but I also be serious when yes. I need to. Yes, yes, yes. That's I don't have to 
provoke them into anger. Amen. 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 But don't get me wrong. That don't mean I didn't make my mistakes. Because I made several right. stupid mistakes when I was young. Amen. 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 I did. Amen. I did. Amen. 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 We all did. That's what we did. You know, and, and it's not just mistakes where, you know, I, I, I uh, uh, provoked them. But I also made mistakes where I didn't do enough. Of course. Amen. But I should have spanked them behind Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. Tore them up when I needed to. Yeah. Right. But I didn't. Yeah. Amen. Okay. Amen. So my point is, we we family character, it takes work. Yeah. It takes time. Woo. From every portion, children have to decide, look, mm -hmm. I am going to honor my parents. Amen. And that just doesn't stop when they Amen. get 18. Yeah. yeah. They have yeah. to decide yeah. to continue. If you got parents that are still Amen. alive, and right. look, I know, I love my mama, yeah. but it ain't always easy between her That's and I, right. she and I. That's right. But I still have to, I still have to. The honor of That's yeah. right. That's right. I got to call it a day. Hallelujah, Jesus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mm, I'm not the only one. Y'all got to yep. call some of y'all's too. I probably should have called yesterday and the day before. I miss my mama. Yeah. 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 So the point is, we still have a job. That's we still right. have a calling. Yes. We still have these. The Bible says even, you know, a lot of us don't understand this. The Bible says over in Timothy that we still supposed to take care of our parents even when they get That's old. right. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. That's, right. That's, right. That's exactly right. Most of us throw them in the nursing home and keep it moving. And keep it moving. That's exactly right. That is exactly right. I'm about about dumb because I know y'all were. Hallelujah, yeah. Jesus. Listen, family character is important, but we can't do this without Christ. Yeah. That's why the word is important. It's important for the yeah. words to dwell richly in us. Amen. In order for Amen. us to do this family thing right. Yes, yes, yes. It has yes. to be done. Yes. Hallelujah. And we'll have less issues, yes. less hiding Hallelujah. of stuff. Amen. Amen. Yeah. That is so true. A lot of us hiding stuff. Amen. Right. Yes, sir. Jesus. Men. Jesus. Hear me good, men. You're called to be men. Hallelujah, Jesus. Let me take my glasses off and let you see my eyes. Amen. You're called to be men. Amen. Right. Amen. Yes. 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 That's what you're called to be. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. You are the men of your house. That's right. That's right. You got to do what you're called to do. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. It's not pretty always. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. If you if you take a look at Adam and Eve, one of the things it says is that there will be a little small speck. <laughs> You better know it. That was one of the things it says because of the, the sin that happened. So that's there's going to be right. a contention. Yeah. My Lord. You want to know why sometimes it's a little tough for women to accept it? Well, that's, that's why. But a good godly woman uh -huh. that follows this word will understand. Okay, let me back up here. Amen. Let me back up. Thank you, Lord. I still Thank want to do you, what Lord. God says. That's right. My flesh may want to do one thing. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah. But my spirit says to do another. Hallelujah. Ain't that right? Ain't that right? Help us, Lord. Help us. Help us, Jesus. And let me say this here. I don't know why the Lord is telling me this, but I'm going to say it. There should be no reason why a man should ever put his hands on a woman. All right, now. Amen. Yeah, Lord. Hey. Bless. Amen. It's with a slow loving hand. Amen. Amen. Did you hear what I just said? I don't know why that's heavy on my yes. heart right now, but I'm going to say that. That's right. There should be no reason. No reason. At all. That's right. Unless it is with a loving hand. Amen. Okay, what the situation is. Hallelujah, Jesus. There should be no reason. That's right. That's right. Even if you gotta protect yourself, man, you don't ever have to put a hard hand on them. Amen. Right. I need you to understand Jesus. that. Yes, sir. And women, mm -hmm. you don't have to go through it. That's right. Oh. You don't have to go through a man putting his hand. You don't have to go through it, women. Yeah, that is so true, man. You don't have to. No, sir. Not, not in this life. You don't have to do it. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I'm not telling you to run out and get a divorce. I'm simply telling you 
there are ways that you can come out of that. Yeah, we, uh, we can be praying for you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And uh, and I believe the, uh, there is help out there, and I can't it help is. you. I can't get you get you the direction you. if you need it. There are, there are people out there that can that's, help you. That's also. right. You that's should be able to go to your right. pastor and get that. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Right. Yeah. All right. That's all I'm gonna say. Stand to your feet, church. Amen. Stand to your feet. Thank you, Lord. Church, listen. You are the church. Thank you, Jesus. People should be able to come to you too to get help. Amen. Amen. That's right. If people come to you, don't run them away. Amen. Amen. You don't know what they're going through. Right. Hallelujah, Jesus. Talk Hallelujah, to them. Jesus. Find out if there's something you can do to help them. Amen. Even if you can't guide them, send them to somebody that can. Amen. Hallelujah, Jesus. All right? Amen. Amen. Because unfortunately, I can stay up here and I can preach. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Family values all day long. All day. But there are a lot of families that's in trouble. Amen. Amen. Yes, sir. Good family. And they need help. Yes, yes Lord. Lord. They need it. Yes, Lord. And we forget sometimes that as the church, we're here for them. That's mm -hmm. right. All the Amen. We're here for them. Father, in Jesus' name, we love you. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you. Father, if there's anything I miss, please, Father, just guide me and guide the church. Yes, yes Lord. Lord. Thank you. Thank you. Because it breaks my heart when I see families Thank you, going through things that they don't have to. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Have mercy, Jesus. Don't do Thank you, Jesus. Guide us, Father, to yes, be the best God. that we can be to help That's others. Right. Yes, Lord. Jesus. God. Sometimes, Father, we sweat the small stuff way too much. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. We let the major things be minor and the minor things be major. Have mercy, Lord. Have mercy. Yes, yes, yes. So please help us, Father, to be like you. In the name of Jesus. Please help us to be that light that you tell us to, to be. In the name of Jesus. Be that salt that you tell us to be. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. If there's anyone that needs Jesus as their Savior, Father, give us the words yes, Lord. to share. Thank you. That testimony to give. Yes, Lord. Thank you. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Come. Come.